and hopefully get my team gold. And that's the goal for one athlete, and it could soon become a reality. A Monticello man will be traveling to Florida to represent Central Illinois. He's competing in the Special Olympics next year. WCI3's Bryce Beeman joins us. And Bryce, you went bowling with him today. That's right. I got the honor to bowl with Todd Pettycourt. He will be representing Illinois in the Special Olympics. And he even showed me a few tricks on how he plans to bring home the gold. Clearly, that wasn't me getting a strike. It was Monticello's very own Todd Pettycourt. And that wasn't the only strike he threw. There we go. I've been bowling technically since I was like six, uh, sixth grade. And um, I've been practicing and practicing, getting better, and bowling, bowling on leagues. Pettycourt is heading to the Special Olympics next year. He's on the Golden Eagle Special Olympic bowling team. Just competing against uh, other bowlers that are actually better than me because bowling against be better bowlers just get, get me better and just I, I hope to get at the top one, one day. But he is at the top. Out of 40,000 Special Olympic athletes in Illinois, Petticourt is one of nearly 70 athletes selected to represent Illinois in the 2022 Special Olympic Games in Orlando, Florida. And he's definitely excited and honored to go. It's a big old accomplishment for me. Like, I'm very, very excited. It's my very first time ever going to nationals. Pettycourt will be one of four members on the soil bowling team, and he's ready to bring home the gold. Very excited to get to know um, my fellow team members and my coach and um, just other uh, competition. He says he's hopeful his family will be able to come watch him compete because he says they are the reason he picked up the bowling ball in the first place. The reason why I'm uh, like in the bowling is because it runs in my family and um, I just kind of picked it up from my grandpa. Bowling is just one of my favorite sports that I've always loved to do in my whole life. Pettycourt is known at several bowling alleys I called and he said he wants to thank his coaches and mentors for helping him reach this accomplishment. The Special Olympics will take place in June. Jess? It looks like he's going to do very well based on what we just saw. That plays very good. All right, Bryce, thank you. There are 18 sports in the Special Olympics next year. Games were founded back in 1968 and they've taken place here in the U.S. and also in places including Austria, South Korea and Greece.